Padre, I may have someone who can give you information on Yuri and Polito. I'm listening. One of my lieutenants managed to escape from them. He fled to a village called Kulta. Rather than give my man up to the cartel, the villagers hid him. Goddamn bravery right there. In response, Santa Blanca raised every home and executed all the villagers. Fuck. My lieutenant is still being kept alive. Probably so he can be killed in an even more painful way. Understood. We're heading to Kulta now. Alright, let's go do it. Alright. We're good. The guy next to me. I've got used to flying off the curb. Short guy. I'm six feet tall, weigh 200 pounds, and I'm a marine. The guy next to me is. We're going. We're going. Short guy. And the guy next to him, he's six feet. This how soldiers do things. You're gonna hit our green guy. Ah! He's gone. He's out of it. We're coming up on a. I don't want to have to explain it. Ugh, so hard to drive. Are we in like a tree farm? It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright, back on the road. <laughs> on the road again! <laughs> <sighs> what is Cultus Prisoner? Ooh, what? You saw us coming! <laughs> what are you talking about? That car almost hit us. They don't care, man. They don't care. <laughs> uh. Gosh, these roads are so unproductive and gas wasting. Wow, this is pretty. We're still 900 meters out, man. You done messed up the car. Earlier, when I was going through the other way, taking a shortcut. What is that green car? Those are the rebels. They're the people that help us, you know? Oh. Why are they going the other way? They're not always helping us. <laughs> they got lives too, you know. Yeah, but me, yeah. Oh my goodness! Ooh, you just missed him. <laughs> oh. Oh. And we're getting close. Things like are on fire. Smoldering. Keep an eye out for the rebel they've got. Uh oh, there's red people here. There's a lot of red people around us. Some supplies we can tag over here, actually. So let's. We're being bag suspected. Up. I know we always come in too close. We'll fix that later. Later. Just tag these supplies. Ooh, level five. I got two oh. All right, you see these guys? They can't see us, but you can see them. Hold on, wait, let me uh, get <gasps> my sniper. You see, they hung somebody. Oh my god. They, they got a dog. Did. All right, they're walking away. Let me get my sniper. Are you ready? Yeah. You got it. You got on the left or the right? Right. All right, three, two, one. We both missed. Tango Shit! Sorry. We're gonna... <laughs> we'll fight. Just uh, make sure you got the gun out that has a lot of bullets. Ooh, nice shot. I'll go on a little bit more. Try not to get too close. Oh my goodness, I shot one on accident. He jumped in my way. Alright, I'm gonna advance. I'll move up a little bit. You cover. Can you tuck and roll like in Division? I know I talk about it a lot, but. Uh, I don't know, baby. I don't know. I'm oh down. no, you're down. You just. Not, not my concentration. Always talk about the bitch. I'm sorry. God damn. Oh, but thank you. You're amazing. I know. Ooh. 
got him. I be getting headshots, take a lot of shots, but still get them. In weapons case, I'm trying not to get shot though. Where is he? I got him. Hey, there's a lot of people just hanging around. It's a village. I'm talking about like hanging around. <laughs> it's fucked up, but yeah, that's, that's what's happening right now. Like actually hanging? <laughs> yeah. Ammo, if you need it. Uh, I'm good right now. Just trying to find the people that are shooting at me. It's so hard to see everybody. Where these bullets flying, flying from. I see some people up there though. Oh my goodness. Where are you, babe? I'm in this house. I moved up a little bit more. I almost got down again, but I'm not going to. Whew. Where are you, man? What? I'm back here with these guys. Not you, the guy shooting me. Like, it's not fair. I can't see him. I'm almost in the building that we need to go in. If you can just. I'm coming. Yeah. Got him. There he was. Little rascal. Alright, let's go inside here. I think it's this way? I don't know. Yep, inside here. Up here, maybe? Oh, look who I'm about the. <laughs> That's what you They're get. Alright, so there's just one guy up there. And that's not the way in. How do you get in? Maybe the front door. He was just waiting on us to make uh, the slip up, too. Okay, it is the front door. I'll wait for you to get around. There you go. How do I always lose you? Which way do you go? Oh, and it's not the house. Just go inside the building. Oh, young gringos, help me get out of here. Use my pistol. I and not use my pistol yet. Oh, okay. All right, that works. You okay, Romano? What do you want from me? Yuri and Polito, the fuckers who tortured you. We're here to make them pay for what they did. But we need to know where they took you. We didn't travel far. I... I remember that much. And it was quiet. Out in the country somewhere. There... There was a smell. Like old animal skins. That's all I know. I... I'm sorry. It's alright. At least now we know they're close by. Gracias. Hey. Mission complete. That was pretty easy, not gonna lie. We're getting better at this, babe. Hey, I'm level five. Me too. You wanna mess around with your skills or what? Yeah. Hey, did you hear the Pentagon had too many generals, so they decided to get rid of some of them? About damn time. Well, somebody with the Joint Chiefs came up with the idea of offering $10,000 of severance pay for each inch of the general's body. The generals could be measured any way they chose. An Air Force general goes first. He's a smart guy, so he says he wants to be measured from head to toe. They measure him and come up with 70 inches. So he accepts a severance of $700,000. Next up was an Army general. This guy says he wants to be measured from the tip of his right finger to the tip of his left finger. The measurement comes out to 80 inches. The Army general smiles and takes a severance of $800,000. So the two generals are mighty damn pleased with themselves. But this Marine General's been watching the whole thing, and after a couple minutes, he steps up and says, You pukes are gonna measure me from the tip of my dick to the bottom of my balls. Man, Marine Generals are kinky. The men doing the measuring are confused. Sir, are you sure you understand how this works? Just do it, maggot! The Marine General barks, and then he drops his trousers. Well, the two men get out the measuring tape, they steal their courage, and they get to work. 
So they start at the tip of his dick, but as they work their way down, they see the general's got no balls. Plot twist. One of the men says, Sir, where are your balls? Left them back in Vietnam. <laughs> Let it go.